We're now going to look at the process for fitting the projector. If using a shim, fit this first, and then fit the projector bracket to the shim. If using spacers, fit them to the bracket. Use hand tools only to do this. Using power tools can cause the parts to split and may void the warranty. Fit the light curtain to the bracket assembly. Again, use only hand tools. Using power tools can damage the parts. Fit the projector to the projection arm, as per the graphic on page 19 of the install manual. Lift the projector assembly onto the bracket. And fit the securing bolts. Fit these by hand to allow the projection arm to move during image alignment, as per graphics on page 20 of the install manual. Connect cables to the rear of the projector. As standard, the projector is supplied with an IEC mains cable a mini USB cable to USB A cable and a VGA cable as per the graphics on page 22 of the install manual. Once the cables are connected to the rear of the projector you can switch it on. Align the projected image to the projection surface. If the projection surface has a frame around it you will need to make sure there is at least a 12mm gap between it and the edge of the projected image. Finally, fit the cable covers to the projector.